is like that's a deal breaker what are you doing my best friend gonna be in my wedding he may not be bombastic side eye hi i'm here with alejandra joyden and i'm here with jayla and would you let your significant other have a best friend of the opposite sex have a best friend of the opposite sex no why not because you have me period sis <laughs> why why do you need another girl best friend i have a boy best friend <laughs> but listen we've been friends since childhood that's the only way it counts like but his family thinks of me as like bro and little sis like you know what i'm saying that's the dynamic they know you cute mm -mm. yeah as long as they don't give me anything to worry about i won't be worried so what would they do that would get you worried like where do you draw the line um so if there was like a guy you really liked and he said that was like that's a deal breaker what are you doing my best friend gonna be in my wedding he may not be bombastic side eye criminal offensive side eye but if i really if i really do like the dude like my best friend will take the space I'm here with Dallas, uh, Millie, Britt. I'm here with Dominique Romain, Jacob Kao, Peyton Parker. And if your significant other cheated, would you stay with them? And the question of the day, first one is, if your significant other cheated on you, would you stay with them? No. Why not? They don't respect me, so I'm not respecting them. I'm out of there. Yeah, I don't think I'd stay either. Yeah, I lost all trust. Kind of depends on the situation. <laughs> Um, I, uh, I want to say no. Like, cheat, like, what? Like, in person, I like, went to meet up with somebody. Or, like, texting, like, oh, see, yeah. If they went out to meet up with somebody, then, yeah, it's over. But, like, texting, that's something different. Like, DMs, that's something different. But I also know myself. <laughs> so, I think it would depend on how much I really like the person. Like, cheating how? Like, what do they do? <laughs> Have you been cheated on? No. Have y'all? Yeah. Of course. Of course. Okay. Have y'all cheated before? Nah. They're lying. What's your limit? Oh, I don't know. Yes, I would not be with them if they cheated on me. <laughs> no, I would not stay with them. I'm not lying. Bro. Why are you lying? I'm not lying. <laughs> I'm so lying? serious. I never cheated, bro. You have to give a full answer. Like, why are you lying? Ladies and gentlemen, we got them. <laughs> yeah, like. What do you mean? <laughs> I lied because. What's your limit? I don't know. I, I, I think if I. What's too far to the point where you're like, okay, I'm done? Well, um... <laughs> I'm proud. I'm loyal, bro. Like, if it come down to it and I'm really locked in, I'm not doing all that. It's like, in a committed relationship and you, like, sleep with somebody else. I mean, it just depends on how much I like you, to be honest. Yeah. Your friend said you're lying, though. She's lying. She cheated, bro. <laughs> Check her. Check her right now. And would you let your significant other have a best friend of the opposite sex? Uh, yes, but if they've hooked up before, like, there's been any type of, like, they've liked each other, like, in the past, then, no, she's got to go. Yeah, I mean, these are my closest friends, so I don't think it would make sense. <laughs> I'm going to say yes, but when I think about it, like, my dad doesn't have any female best friends, my mom doesn't have any male best friends, so... <laughs> I'm just gonna... I'm just not gonna be your friend, like, what the fuck? I think if you're trying to limit someone's friends, then that's, like, a red flag. No, I'm a lover girl, so I don't cheat. So which one of y'all is lying? He don't know me, so... And what's your name? Jaden. Jaden. Would you stay with somebody if they cheated on you? Hi, I'm here with... Tyler. OT. KJ. DeAndre. Question is, if your significant other cheated on you, would you stay with them? No. You said my significant other cheated on me? Would I stay with them? Nah. Have you before? You paused. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, no, that's just cut. Not at all. Not at all? No. You took kind of long to answer. No, I wouldn't. You sure? <laughs> What's the limit, like, you consider cheating? Like, where you're like, okay, I'm done. Uh, if she... Mm. Fake mark! If she link another nigga. If she, like, give another nigga head. That's wild. No. <laughs> In the clip. <laughs> like, nigga. Kissing, nigga. Kissing, fucking, all that shit's cut. Any of it? Yeah. Uh, my bad, my bad. To be honest, if she had sex with any other man's raps, then I ain't gonna cap to you. So anything before that, she could stay? 
<laughs> it depends like like if you at like a party and like niggas like bro your girl like dance on a nigga like hugging a nigga too much and I, I see some shit like that and we gotta talk but yeah. if it's anything further than that yeah it's wild yeah it's cut it's anything cut. that's like like od like don't do nothing you wouldn't do you feel what i'm saying you don't right. want nothing you, you want me to do it no don't intimacy do it. with any other man and the second question is would you let your significant other have a best friend of the opposite sex no for hell no I might have one, so she cool. What's too much? Like, when she starts doing what with him, is it too much? And you're like, he's got to go. Too much laughing and shit. You start spending, like, a little bit too much, like, too much time with him. You feel what I'm saying? If you like that girl a lot, would you cut off your girl best friend for her? Most definitely. Explain to my friend, like, look, this is my shorty right now. You're not giving me none of this in treatment. You're a friend of me. So let me throw you off. And she respected it, and then my sh my ex shorty. Honestly, I have no respect for her no more. Just, just know that. Okay, thank y'all. Okay, thank you guys. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you guys.